go as slow as shadow on the mic I play to win, never to lose In the contest of champions I'm the one they choose So I'm the one that my moves are slick Dexterity more heavily, I dodge quick Class champ, I'm the master of the game Cosmic science, skill tech mutant I claim Arena and chill grind, that's how I roll No stress, no drama, just on patrol The fight, I'm swift, my tactics excite Lost shadows in the arena, ready to ignite Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So, it's season 48, and this is war number 10. Only two more wars after this one. And looks like we're going up against an alliance called Rage and Grace. Interesting. Okay. Let's see who they banned. Iceman, Kushala, and Bishop. I've seen them banned before. Okay. Take a look here, see what we got going on. Hey, that's interesting. They're flipped. Usually I see them on the reverse. I'll have to think about that one. Okay. So I'm thinking Gallon, but let me see here. I hate fighting this guy. I really do. Uh, da, 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 da. Yeah, I don't think he gets, I can't remember, but I don't think he gets a, um, armor up. Maybe he does. I don't know. I'll have to look, but even if he doesn't, I'm bringing Hulkling. So, um, let's see. Gallon can take Odin who I know gets armor ups. Huh. <clears throat> now, Claire can handle this super uh, scroll even here. I would just have to make sure I stay in uh, her curse of blood. And then, of course, Hulkling can take out that future Ant-Man over there. So, Hulkling, Claire, Gallon. I mean, Hulkling could take out that Odin as well. Let's see who we got. Ooh, interesting. Um, <clears throat> So, that's definitely, um, Hulkling can do that fight. So, yeah, I don't even have to, let me see, can I bring someone else? Oh, I can take that Sauron as well if I, if I don't bring Gallon and I use Hulkling, Hulkling can do like three of these fights. And then Claire can do that uh, Super Scroll. And then I can bring Lady Deathstrike for that uh, Sauron there. Okay. I think that's what we'll do. Uh, now, I don't know if I'll get assigned to it, but I'm going to mention it. All right. Let's get on to the fighting. All right. So I'm going in with Hulkling, Claire, and Lady Deathstrike. All right. And I'm happy to go in with Lady Deathstrike because I really wanted to test her out uh, against that Sauron. And we get to do that. All right, so first up, we've got... I do not like fighting this guy. I don't even like looking at him. I don't know why, but I just don't like him. I didn't want him in my roster. And then when I got him in my roster, I certainly didn't want to rank him up because then I would have to use him at least in arena, no, 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 no. Don't like him. Um, but he's not that bad to fight. Um, pretty uh, straightforward too. I don't even think he gets an armor up. So look at this. Look at the, the damage I'm doing already. Look at this. Look at this damage. Just ripping him up. So I'm not too worried about him. I don't even need to fire a special if I don't want to. Now, of course, I didn't go unblockable there because I didn't have enough of the uh, cosmic charges. 
but I will. There you go. I just wanted to finish like that. I didn't need to fire a special off, but I wanted to fire a special off. Do not like him. Catch that to the face. All right, so anyway, that fight is done. I believe that was just a throwaway fight. Now we've got Odin. And this fight here, if you guys might remember, I had a little bit of an issue with the Odin here. I thought it was going to be a straightforward fight. But if you look at the uh, nodes, he can't be nullified. Which means, unless you have somebody that is immune to the power drain, you're going to be taking damage. So I'm looking here, and I'm like, oh boy. I'm like, okay, I have an idea on how I want to do this fight. Okay? Even without him... Um, without... Uh, him being able to be nullified all right so you see that i'm doing a lot of heavies okay a lot of heavy attacks and that's so that i can get my power a little bit more okay now bait this out okay cool cool all right just want to get and you can see I'm, I'm getting power lock as well so now that i have special two i'm trying to wait that power lock out Okay, and then here we go. And his, he cannot be nullified, but you'll notice that his armor went away because of her buff immunity. Now, the reason I started getting hit there is because I just noticed that in the fight. I wasn't expecting that. I was like, okay, he's not going to get nullified, so I need to keep on, you know, parry, heavy, parry, heavy, and then fire my special to get my health back. Okay. But I was not expecting no more armor. So at this point, I could just play him like normal. But I hadn't noticed that. And I was like, okay, well, I'm just going to keep going, you know, get my uh, health back. But I'm like, okay, she can do this fight pretty easily. So next time, I'm going to get to that special two, fire it off, and then I'm going to play like normal. Because it doesn't look like he's going to get his armor up back. And if he does, okay, we'll do it again and get rid of it. For some reason, I wasn't thinking that her, her buff in um, immunity would get rid of his armor up like that. So it's not a nullification. It is a buff on them making them immune. So pretty cool. Pretty cool. I love Claire. Some people don't like her. I like Claire, okay? Anyway, so I heal up a little bit, you know, just in case there's some other shenanigans, but I'm pretty sure uh, the Super Scroll is going to be pretty straightforward uh, and an easy fight, okay? So not planning to go really out of uh, Curse of Blood. And there's the armor ups, but I'm in Curse of Blood, so I'm not going to get any... Um, bleeds on me and you can see he's not bleed immune so i can just keep on going now the only danger that i have found is that sometimes it'll read my last attack as a light attack and i don't want to do a light attack to switch her but if it does that and he has an armor up i'll bleed out real quick and i might die before I can get back to the Curse of Blood. That has happened to me before, okay? But we're not having that problem now. Looks like we're doing very well. No reason not to stay in Curse of Blood. As you can see, my health is looking good. And then he does that. It happens. And then he does that. Yep, it happens. He knows he's about to go down. And so now the AI just starts losing its dang mind, okay? Suddenly it becomes a parry master. Suddenly it gets jabby. You know, it just be walking up into you. Wow. Just hit you with a jab. And you're just like, wait, block. Nope. Jab, jab. You know, but we got him down. He was like, no, you ain't getting out of that fight with all that help. No, sir.
you're not doing it. But it's okay because he went down. All right, so now we've got this fight. You know, it's a pretty uh, standard fight at this point. You know, you try to wait out that armor and then hit into the block, hit into the block. There we go. Get those pierce. Sometimes he don't want you to hit into his block. I wonder why not. And so now you should be good to uh, just fight him like normal. You don't really need to evade any of that. You can block it all. Hulkling is tough. Oh, yep, yeah, tough. All right, anyway, get my uh, little charges up, get some more pierce. And as long as you keep your pierce up, you're not gonna have to worry about the armors. All right, here we go. Yep, no problems here. Ooh, yeah. Still got my pierce. Mm-hmm. Oh, there we go. Woo, I almost messed up because I didn't have enough charges or else I would have gone unblockable earlier, but I got the charge I needed just in time. That was close because he would have come back and probably wrecked me with the way he be doing. Ain't no telling. All right, now for the fight that I was waiting for. I was very eager to see how my Lady Deathstrike does. And granted, we are at a lower tier than I was previously. So I'm not taking as much damage as I was. So it's not really a equivalent fight, if I remember correctly. I don't think they get as much attack bonus or whatever. Somebody leave a comment and let me know. But from tier two to tier four, let me know. Okay. So anyway, we're dealing with this Sauron. Lady Deathstrike shouldn't have any problem. The only time I died to this Sauron here on this node was when I took a special two. And it was the last hit of the special two. Not even the first hit. But the last one just wiped out all my health. Now, at that time, I was using a rank three six star. And then a rank four six star. So I think it was he was um, I think she was rank four when that particular fight happened, if I remember correctly. And so this one is a rank two seven star. So that's a huge difference. So I'm not sure, you know, if that makes the biggest difference or what have you. All right. See, look at this. Like this. Bam. Look at that. That was nothing. I'm safe. Ain't no way he can beat me. I could take all his uh, specials and I'll heal back up. No problem. Um, but I don't know if that right there would happen if we were in tier two. I don't know. Okay. See, look at that. Again. Boom. And I'm telling you, I, that, that would have taken me out. All right. So anyway, at least right now, she is going to be a very safe option for Sauron on that node until they change everything. All right. So we've got one more fight left. And this fight here is going to be a Hulkling fight. Now, I have been mostly volunteering for these two nodes because usually I have a good counter for both of those nodes so I can take both the fights. Um, but sometimes someone else has a, a much better option uh, and they'll get assigned... Uh, you know, one of the fights. But Hulkling generally can rip up whoever is on this node, generally speaking. He is a great option. He is my MVP and has been my MVP for a very long time. Okay. And I love the fact that he can't be power drained. That is beautiful. Okay. Especially for this node. Because with a lot of others, you know, um, I tried coming in here with um, Kitty Pride, and I thought it was gonna be a quick and easy fight. I kept getting my power drained and that was that. 
And I'm like, really? Really? Now, as you can see here, I do not need to fire a special off. But I want to do it anyway. Got to do it. It's just fun. Seeing that special, ripping them apart. Yeah, we got to do it. All right, so that is going to do it for my fights in this war. And we'll be back in a moment. And you guys will find out how this war ended. And we're back. And unfortunately, we lost this war. Now, we are slipping. Uh, we're slipping down to uh, Platinum 4, which is not where we really want to be. Uh, so hopefully we can uh, start winning. Uh, here we go. This one was a, a fairly close one, it looks like. Yeah, this one was fairly close. All right. Um, shout out to our MVPs here. But look at that. Three attack bonus, looks like. All right. But anyway, that is going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Take care. Hit the like button if you enjoyed it. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. And you all have a blessed day. Arena and chill grind, that's how we roll No stress, no drama, just on patrol In the fight he's swift, his tactics be tight Those shadows in the arena ready to ignite From the streets to the screen, his skills be renowned In the world of Marvel, Lord, the King Crown